O God, come to our aid. O Lord, make haste to help us. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Alleluia. The martyrs living now with Christ in suffering were tried. Their anguish overcome by love when on his cross they died. Across the centuries they come in constancy unmoved. Their loving hearts make no complaint, in silence they approve. No man has ever measured love or weighed it in his hand. But God, who knows the inmost heart, gives them the promised land. Praise Father, Son, and Spirit, blessed who guides us through the night. In ways that reach beyond the stars to everlasting light. Lawrence entered heaven as a martyr. He bore witness to the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. I love the Lord, for he has heard the cry of my appeal. For he turned his ear to me in the day when I called him. They surrounded me, the snares of death, with the anguish of the tomb. They caught me sorrow and distress. I call on the Lord's name. O Lord, my God, deliver me. How gracious is the Lord and just. How God has compassion. The Lord protects the simple hearts. I was helpless, so he saved me. Turn back my soul to your rest. For the Lord has been good. He has kept my soul from death, my eyes from tears, and my feet from stumbling. I will walk in the presence of the Lord, in the land of the living. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, Forever and ever. Lawrence entered heaven as a martyr. He bore witness to the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Saint Lawrence cried out, saying, I will rejoice openly, since I have been found worthy to be consumed to be a consumed sacrifice for Christ. I trusted even when I said, I am sorely afflicted. And when I said in my alarm, No man can be trusted. How can I repay the Lord for his goodness to me? The cup of salvation I will raise. I will call on the Lord's name. My vows to the Lord I will fulfill before all his people. O oh, precious in the eyes of the Lord is the death of his faithful. Your servant, Lord, your servant am I. You have loosened my bonds. A thanksgiving sacrifice I make, I will call on the Lord's name. My vows to the Lord I will fulfill 
before all his people, in the courts of the house of the Lord, in your midst, O Jerusalem. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever. The God who is, who was, and is to come, at the end of the ages. St. Lawrence cried out, saying, I will rejoice openly, since I have been found worthy to be consu a consumed sacrifice for Christ. I give thanks to you, O Lord Jesus Christ, because you have found me worthy to enter your gates. Worthy are you, our Lord and God, to receive glory and honour and power, for you created all things, and by your will they existed and were created. Worthy are you, O Lord, to take the scroll and to open its seals, for you were slain, and by your blood you ransomed men for God, from every tribe and tongue and people and nation. You have made us a kingdom and priests to our God, and we shall reign on earth. Worthy is the Lamb who was slain, to receive power and wealth, and wisdom and might, and honour and glory and blessing. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. I give thanks to you, O Lord Jesus Christ, because you have found me worthy to enter your gates. My dear people, if you can have some share in the sufferings of Christ, be glad, because you will enjoy a much greater gladness when his glory is revealed. It is a blessing for you when they insult you for bearing the name of Christ, because it means that you have the spirit of glory, the spirit of God resting on you. You have tested us, God. You have brought us out into freedom again. You have tested us, God, and you have brought us out into freedom again. You have refined us like silver. You have tested us, God, and you have brought us out into freedom again. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. You have tested us, God, and you have brought us out into freedom again. Then Blessed Lawrence said, This night of mine is not dark, rather everything shines with light. My soul glorifies the Lord, my spirit rejoices in God, my Saviour. He looks on his servant in her lowliness. Henceforth all ages will call me blessed. The Almighty works marvels for me. Holy is name. His mercy is from age to age. On those who fear him, he puts forth his arm in strength, and scatters the proud hearted. He casts the mighty from their thrones, and raises the lowly. He fills the starving with good things, sends the rich away empty. He protects his really servant, remembering his mercy, the mercy promised to our fathers, to Abraham and his sons forever. Praise the Father, the Son, and Holy Spirit, both now and forever, world without end. Then Blessed Lawrence said, This night of mine is not dark, rather everything shines with light. Let us give thanks to the King of Martyrs, 
For this is the hour when he offered himself in the Last Supper, and laid down his life on the cross. We praise you, Christ the Lord. We praise you, Christ our Saviour, example and strength of the martyrs, because you have loved us to the end. We praise you, Christ the Lord. Because you have promised repentant sinners the reward of eternal life. We praise you, Christ the Lord. Because you have called the church to offer the blood of the new and eternal covenant, the blood shed for the remission of sins. We praise you, Christ the Lord. Because you have brought us to this day with the gift of faith intact. We praise you, Christ the Lord. Because of the many brothers who today have come to share in your saving death. We praise you, Christ the Lord. At the Saviour's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Lord God, you inspired St. Lawrence with so ardent a love that his life was renowned for the service of your people, and his death for the splendour of his martyrdom. Help us to love what he loved, and to live as he showed us. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, God, forever and ever. Amen. The Lord bless us, and keep us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life.